finally time 2023 scooter ball we are getting picked up here by dave this morning hold up before we get into this video let me give you a brief history of what we call scooter ball this is dave he was one of the first of us to get a scooter and he convinced several other friends including me to join him i think he missed his calling as a salesman because he convinced a total of six people to go on the first scooter ball in 2019. We rode the west central half of the state of Indiana, checking out covered bridges and Amish country. Who knew they played basketball? Every time I touch a basketball, I'm, I'm breaking the rules. Oh, we get it, Caleb. It was magical, and we quickly realized this would be a yearly event. Well, we all know what happened in 2020. We mainly did local riding together as a scooter gang. In 2021, we trailered our scoots down to Tennessee and rode around the Great Smoky Mountains. In 2022, we went down to Arkansas and rode around the Ozark Mountains. It was miserably hot, but the scenery more than made up for it. Not to mention we had our first scooter ball ferry crossing. We were almost murdered by an Ozark Mountain man, and we picked up two new members, Chip and Andrew. And that brings us to this year. We all love Tennessee so much, we decided to head back down to discover new roads and new adventures. Uh, we loaded all of our scooters last night, which was uh, which is always fun and difficult. Uh, six total, and then a seventh on the back of uh, on the back of Dave's uh, Escalade. And so uh, I'm just waiting to get picked up. Uh, driving from Indianapolis today down to Townsend, Tennessee, Gatlinburg, uh, Smoky Mountains area. It's gonna be it's gonna be awesome. Uh, so excited. <laughs> All right, here we are, 2023 Scooter Ball. We actually just uh, pulled into town, got the bikes unloaded, uh, and uh, it's, I don't know, a little after four, so we're gonna actually jump on here and do a little bit of riding before it gets dark and before we head to dinner, so it should be an awesome time. But first, gas. Gus to buy a drink. Going into the Great Smoky Mountain National Park, heading to Cage Cove. Uh, it's gonna be awesome. This yeah, is gonna be so much fun. We're just having a run down the first evening of the scooter ball. Technically, I guess the scooter ball really starts tomorrow. Oh, yeah, I guess you're right. Although, uh, it starts now. It started at eight o'clock this morning when my scooter was trying to fall off the back of the truck. And it almost went through the windshield. Yeah, the straps. The back windshield. The ratchet straps uh, weren't holding it, and so I hit the brakes. I was like, hey, should we check the scooter? It looks loose. Justin <laughs> says, yeah, I think we should. I hit the brakes. It hits the rear window. Oh, my gosh. So, uh... Dude, as hot as it is, these people over here in the uh, rafts, like, they're onto something. That sounds awfully nice. They're going to get that brain-eating amoeba? Um, amoeba? Yeah. Mo moeba? Yeah, yeah. No, that's only on lakes. I don't think that's in oh, rivers. It's creeks. I think Tennessee creeks are pretty clean. Yeah. Is it just me or can you feel that cold air? Like this feels great. It feels amazing in the shade. Oh, I love this place. Uh, petting wildlife prohibited? No, it said picking wildlife, picking wildflowers. Oh, Dave, you're fine to pet anything you want while oh, you're here. Oh, I'm going to pet so much stuff. <laughs> Two motor vehicles. Uh-oh, what's the case code closed to... No, no. Closed Wednesdays to motor vehicles. It's Wednesday. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, regroup. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, we're going somewhere else. All right, it's closed to motor vehicles, so let's head back towards Gatlinburg area. Yeah. You, are you, are you taking dinner there? Or? Just today. On Wednesdays. It's just Wednesdays. So uh, let's head this way and we'll figure it out. All right, adventure on three. Ready? One, two, three. Adventure. <laughs> We're heading to Cades Cove and discovered on Wednesdays the loop is closed to motor vehicles and scooters um, qualify for that and even Justin's small motorcycle qualifies for that. So we turned around, we are heading towards the Gatlinburg area, but we're actually going to uh, 
this road tees into a road that goes to Gatlinburg and Pigeon Forge, or you can go the other way to Clingman's Dome. And so we're gonna head to Clingman's Dome. There we go, through the tunnels. Can't help but honk the horn, red the engine. Next to the comp at Clean right. Dome. Man, that was a hike. It was. What did you think of it, Chip? I had a great time. Yeah. It wasn't in the brochure, but. I know, okay. I don't remember signing up for a hike. Yeah. But it is a cool view. That was a very long hike, but worth it, I think. It was fun. I've never done it before. Now I can say I've done it. I don't want to do it again. I would like to have the, I would like to state that we won't be doing any more hiking on this trip. <laughs> Dude, that mountain range is just spectacular. Oh my gosh. Nut. Yeah, that's incredible. Just incredible. Woo! That was amazing. Like, all right, here's a uh, here's Mexican restaurant numero uno of the trip, and we've actually been to this one. It's very good. After dinner, we rode home in the dark, which we don't like doing, but it happens, and that was the end of day point five.